The next song, this is by BTS. BTS. This is by a group called BTS. Have you heard of them? BTS. No. What? I think she's so familiar. Now, when it comes to like boy bands in Korea these days. You got a meatballs list. Girl, I told you, chicken teriyaki. It's really juicy. So, when it comes to boy groups mm -hmm. in Korea, EXO and BTS are like up there. They're top. They're like head to head. Mm -hmm. It's also to a point where like EXO fans and BTS fans, sometimes they be having beef. Uh-uh, it is not that deep. It, it be getting deep for them. <laughs> I always say this, and it seems like this. In Korea, the crazier your fans are, the more successful the person is. And it used to be, people used to be like, man, EXO fans are insane. EXO fans, and they still kind of are. But these days, when I went there, the BTS fans were the like crazy, crazy ones. ones. <laughs> so BTS is up there, like, you know what I mean? And yeah. fun fact, they even won a Billboard Music Award. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, so... Um, so BTS stands for Pangtan Sonyanda. <laughs> Don't laugh. Pangtan Sonyanda means, Pangtan means bulletproof, and Sonyanda is like Boy Scouts. You told me that. Yeah, so their name translates into Bulletproof Boy Scouts. By the way, BTS stands for Pangtan Sonyanda, which literally means Bulletproof Boy Scouts. Like, and uh, apparently they recently changed the acronym for when they're in the Western world to instead of standing for the Korean name, they changed it to Beyond the Scene, BTS to Beyond the Scenes. Oh, okay, okay. But when you're in, when they're in Korea, it sounds for Pangtan Sonyanda because that's what they debuted with. That's their latest song is called Not Today. Mm -hmm. Not Today? Yes. And Do they have 10 guys too? No, actually, they have seven. Oh. Less, oh. but. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, without further ado, go ahead and give it a listen. Mm. <laughs> wow. Okay, MTV. <laughs> One thing I noticed, they be going all out for music videos. Yeah, when it comes down to this, it's not how America is. They got dancing, they got the the, the outfits, the cartoon effects, they got the green screen, the everything. setting. Kind of, what? The platform they put there, I'm sure. This took, they took the time to put the platform there. You know, this has to be the green screen. Green screens mm -hmm. are crazy today. Nah, it's free, not green screen. Uh, it looks like it could be it's green screen. Not today. This song reminds me of uh, Justin Bieber and Jada Smith. Never say never. Don't say don't play games like that. <laughs> <laughs> Sheesh, that's a lot of backup dancing. Mm -hmm. Okay, and we're done. Not today. Okay, so what do you guys think? Epic. <laughs> no, for real. That's legit. No it was epic. They give you that movie feel, the action movie. Yeah, 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 I think that's the that's that's the reason why I said epic. Like, to the whole story with it, it was crazy, though. My thing is, like, did they... 
do they really have to like? <laughs> 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 oh, why are you looking? He's always laughing at me. It's all good. No, he... What are your thoughts? Um, the dancing is always nice, but that wasn't. I wasn't really feeling it like that. Mm. Yeah, it's it's it was all right. I guess I didn't really like the song that much. I, I, I was more drawn to the video and like all the action that was going on. Mm -hmm. I, I, really, I really feel like the sound of it, you know, like it's catchy. That's the only thing. But I was into the groove of the, uh, what's it called? EXO and the t uh, the group before them. What were they called? NCT 127. Yeah, those, yeah. those guys. I, I actually like the groove of the music. I can actually groove to This is something I would listen to if I'm in the shower or something like that. Mm -hmm. going for a job. Mm -hmm. This one, it was fun to watch. It was interesting. It was mm. very epic, but it wasn't my... Your cup of tea. Yeah. After watching this video, had I not introduced BTS to, to you, would you assume that these guys were like a big deal or would you just been like, well, you know, just a, just another K-pop group? Yeah, I think they were. Really? Yeah. I don't know. They didn't, like... I wasn't feeling it. Like, they're up there with EXO like that. Yeah, fans wise, like like fame and fan wise, yeah. Mm, they, they yeah. are. <laughs> How about you, Mike? I like the lyrics, catchy. Yeah. It's something I don't know if you play. It's something you can hear in the car. You just, you just like, yeah. <laughs> Somebody walk into the store to. Oh, step song. Yeah. Yeah. To like from <laughs> one like H and M. Mm, really. The music video hit too. Like. It was legit. Whoever thought of this got some crazy imagination. Yeah. I don't yeah. know where that spot is in Korea, but <laughs> it's it's where it's that it's is, so green screen. like, where is that? <laughs> <laughs> I want to know where it is, too. Heck? I don't know if they're known for it, but I personally noticed that their lyrics tend to be very good. And it tends to have, like, a deep meaning. Yeah. So I, I really like their lyrics. So I'm assuming, because, you know, there's a little war between BCS fans and EXO fans. So I'm Are assuming. Are you to come for me? I mean. Y'all can come for me. Us, who do you like better? EXO. Okay. <laughs> she said it, y'all. <laughs> right now in Korea, when it comes to boy groups, EXO and BTS are like head and head. Oh, for real? Yeah, real. like BTS yeah. fans are called ARMY. Like the ARMY. army. They're oh, ARMY. Okay. And then EXO fans are called XOL. XOLs. XOL. So like XOL and, and XOLs and ARMY is always like kind of like fighting. So like, you know. It's so not I, deep though? It's, it's kind of deep, but for people like me, I like EXO, but I also like BTS. It's okay. whatever. But... I guess I should ask you guys, who do you like better, EXO or BTS? I like to go EXO all the way. But then again, you haven't heard enough BTS songs. Exactly, that's the only reason why. If you're yeah, gonna, yeah. if you're really gonna make us pick right now, that's you gotta go EXO yeah, right for right now. Yeah. But then if later on if you hear more BTS, yes. you'll be able to. Yeah, yeah. Okay, don't worry. Maybe maybe one of these days I'll show you more songs. All right. So, this one is called. This is by a group that you guys probably know about because they're very they're famous all over the world. Big Bang. Yeah. Uh, you know Big Bang too? I know Big Bang. How do you know? Twitter. But this last song, this is the final song, and it's by a group called Big Bang. Have you heard of them? Yeah, but I don't. I haven't like heard the music. I've heard of their name. So I said EXO and BTS like head and head right now, yeah. but in general, Big Bang is always gonna be there, like right. the top group because they've been doing yeah. it for a minute. Really? It's kind of like how it's like the top groups for boy groups come and go. So before EXO, back in the day, maybe it was like Shiny. Before yeah. Shiny, it was like Super Junior. So it go it comes and goes in Korea. Big Bang has always been that group that has been like top. When Big Bang come with a song, it's number one. Like yeah. Big Bang is that group that consistently stays on top. Now I told you before that EXO and um, BTS were like big the big names in Korea, mm -hmm. but Big Bang is the consistent top dog. Mm. So when I was in Korea, this song came out and it was everywhere. Like so this song is called Era Moregeta. Okay. Era Moregeta means like and eh, whatever. Like the English title actually here says F it. Like. Okay. Yeah, so it's kind of like that. <laughs> Why don't you try saying it? Era, era, era Moregeta. Moregeta. It's like more, era, more, more guitars. Wow. He got dressed too. Girl. Their English is better. Yeah. 
<laughs> you know, you want to hear what this actually, you want to know what they're actually talking about. I don't know why I like this voice. I always like this voice. I like his voice. <laughs> Whoa, the views are six million. I like him. Look at him. I don't know if you're slow down. Of course it does. That's what I'm doing. And I'm gonna get, get down, yeah. And I'm gonna get down. And I'm gonna get down. Thoughts? That was nice. It was like good vibes, chill. And I like how like they're like just having fun, and, like not doing too much. Maybe it's because like they already have their fan base, so they feel like they don't need to do too much. Mm. So it was really nice. I I liked it. Yeah. So what do you think about it? You could really sense their. How do you say power? Like you could really tell the vibe of somebody who's trying to make it to the top and somebody who's already at the top. Oh. You see, like all the other videos, they were dancing, pop. They went all extravagant with the videos. These guys are just Literally. having fun with the video. You know what I mean? I mean, like I don't know if it's just like this song but like i said like they're not like doing too much they're just like chill having fun you know like like they're ogs like you said so i feel like they don't feel the need to do too much mm. and they can just chill you know because they know their fans are gonna love it regardless mm -hmm. so the lyrics are like this is the chorus, okay? It says, Hum chine noye nun buche ipsu de panchak maraji Ore mani ne ke pone iro tolim Iro chido chori chido mo tenna I pami taga gi jane Na no ne po mane wa ne vila I think I wanna do this one So basically This is the translation He says, you're stealing I don't wanna get I don't wanna get I don't wanna get the girl is like, you're stealing glances at me. Oh. You make my lips dry. This is a feeling that I haven't felt in a, felt in a long time, and I, I can't do anything. Before this night is over, I want you in my arms. Real love, I think I want to just, uh, I won't think about it too much. Oh, oh F it. I love you. I don't want to get that. I don't want to get that. Yeah, so I was feeling it, like, the vibe, the lyrics. When you told me the lyrics, what they actually meant, like, it was cool, like, they was chilling, they went exactly with what the song meaning was, and they put it in the music video. The lyrics, I mean, all the lyrics, honestly, they, they I don't know, they hit you. So, like, it's a song that you gonna remember in your yeah. mind. I think that's how the music what, is, low key. Yeah. Hey, then. So, uh, based on all the th songs that you've seen today, are there any songs that you would listen to again? I listened to that one. Yeah, it was, yeah, I liked it. So, I'm assuming this is your favorite one out of all the songs. <clears throat> mm hmm Okay, okay, okay. Um, in I case there are Korean people watching this, um, why don't you say, let, let me teach you something to say to them in Korean. Yeah. How about you guys say something in Korean? Okay. Um, thank you for watching the video. Okay, thanks. So, 이 영상을 봐줘서 감사합니다. Say it again. 이 영상을 봐주시고. 이 영상. 이 영상. 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 봐줘서. Why are you laughing? 이 영상을. 이 영상. I can't do it again. Okay, 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 okay. Simple. We're just gonna keep it simple. Thank you. Okay. In Korean. Kamsanida. Kamsanida. Thank you. Hey, we're done. Um, don't forget to subscribe. And if you're not following me on Twitter and Instagram, follow me at omg underscore Esther. And you can follow her too if you want to. And you go and thumbs up. <laughs> thumbs up the video. Thumbs up, comment, questions, and yeah, bye guys. Bye bye. Thank you.